Gopoza mam gopozi. Let the spring water seeping from the belly of the earth consistently. So are the rumors that flow through your mouth as you gopoza. To feed the hunger of eager souls and ears. You are the only person in the world that has the special skills to share unconfirmed information about others and still feel content. The world wouldn't be so colorful without your kind though. Yet you maim people's souls without any sympathy. Sharp poisonous tongue is that of a serpent you have, such that you don't seem to be able to control it. The more you are coated, the more the poisonous your tongue becomes. You take each sentence and make it grow quadruple times. You are known to keep a thriving library of rumors. Each piece of news that passes through your ears immediately turns juicy. To you, an innocent conversation between two people turns into a love affair. To you, your friend's marriage is falling apart. To you, your no good neighbor's children have dismally failed the national exams. To you, your colleague's family slept on empty stomachs last night. To you, your boss's wife has an unfashionable dress code. From which planet do you originate from Mamko Bozi, where there is no respect for others? Don't forget that rumors are made by unhappy souls. Don't forget people gossip to make themselves feel better about their insecurities. Don't forget that people gossip to turn the focus away from their pathetic situations. Don't forget that gossips are jealous of the people they gossip about. Don't forget that gossips do so out of boredom. Don't forget that gossips attempt to vent their emotions through distorting information. Don't forget that the rumors you hear about anyone are as true as the ones they hear about you. Take heed therefore, Mam Popozi, to these teachings and reforms. Society is torn apart by your tongue, Mam Popozi. You leave your victims helpless and distraught. You ruin careers and take away food from many people's tables. You bring the downfall of kings and presidents. You tarnish the reputation of others in your way. Yet you see nothing wrong with your passion for Ugu Koboza like a spring. Lest you are not aware, Mam Koboza, there is a species that is superior to yours that you should learn from. The species on whose ears gossip dies when it eats. The species that has great minds that only discuss constructive ideas. The species that checks the authenticity of any news before they pass it on to the next ear. The species that don't form bonds through backbiting others. The species whose silence mocks you. Learn from this basic species and your life will be much more peaceful.